hello, hello, and we're back here for the review of the Insert Padlet. So let's not talk too much, let's just jump right on into it. Swag, bitch. Now, as I'm sitting here, this is a diameter of a regular screw-on padlet. So it is about three and a half inches tall. And the width, we're going to say about five. We're going to say about five inches because of this outside plate. Because usually the regular light pods only have that inside and then they have some kind of bracket. Now this one has two holes on the back here for, I believe, bolts to screw into. So if you wanted to put it just as a regular thing or for extra mounting, I guess. And that's just, because there is two holes here that I... Not too sure. So I believe they have it for bolts behind something or whatever. But the back of it, if I'm correct, should be only about two and two and three quarter. So what I'm eventually going to do is because you can never drill like a hole and then put these into the bumper. What I would eventually do is I'd make a plate, cut a square out of my thing, weld it all together, and then flush it, and then just insert it and insert it out. So it would be easier. But you get four holes, so two here and two here. So let's try it on out. And my wires are long enough, apparently, on these last two. I hadn't had to cut them or anything to make them fit onto the batteries. So let's put positive to negative. I just said that. Positive to negative. Let's put red to positive and negative to the other. The other. Jesus Christ. I haven't seen shit like that in a while. If I go blind after this, I better be getting a lawsuit. Come on. going to take some configuring. Hang on here. I got positive here, right? Yep. Negative here. This is... I'm losing vision. I can still see the lights whenever I blink. That's right. Come on. Uno momentum. Okay, now that all my blindness is gone from the LEDs, here it is. And it's back. So, from what I can tell, these are a lot, like, similar, but not as bright. Like, these seem weak. It seems like the focus point is right in the middle. The outside view. Not really that great. Let's shut off all the lights and see how it looks. Because you, know, you never know until you so know. So, as you can see, I'm in total dark. And positive to positive and negative to negative. Right. Negative, yep. Yep, 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 yep. You're right, you're right. Ooh. It's not as bright. But... See, you can see the review. It's not, it's not that, it's not that bright. You can see it has that one spot point to it. This wouldn't be very good pod lights. But I think for like something that's like cheap and disposable, this is pretty simple. But I mean you can see that the LED light is pretty okay for what it is. Um Oh yeah. Seems cool. Seems good. It's livable. I mean, I'm shining it here, and you can see the darkness behind me. That light bar, however, that was amazing. So, I'm gonna give this one maybe like, like a five out of ten, because I mean, it does show very good potential outside, but not for distance. 
and you can see it's pretty bright right there on camera where it's hitting the lava lamp. But that's just me. So, I mean, if you're sticking out of the car like this, you got some light on the side of you and some light on the side of you. So, but it is pretty wide range. Now, driving into them, they suck. But pointing them at somebody else, it's funny for me. Because everybody shines their LEDs at me all the time. So, this was a review of the Insert LED Pod Light. Now, kind of regretting buying five of them to come in later this week. But, uh, not really. Because they come in, they come in, so what? But, uh, this. This right here. Very good. Very interesting. Could be improved, but very interesting. So, I will have to give this one a 5. The last one I did, which was that long 13-inch, uh, uh, that one, oh my god, took my breath away. That one was literally, um, that one was a 10 out of 10 for me. It, it's, it's the pod light for me. <laughs> so, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hope you all give it a like, follow, and I hope you all stay subscribed to the channel. We are all doing very fun stuff here on the channel, and I hope to be doing some more group activities with friends, hopefully. But if not, I'll be here doing my own thing. And that is quite all right. So have yourselves a wonderful, beautiful, and lovely day, and I hope to see you all in my next video.